running a blog, e-commerce store, or any type of website without HTTPS puts your user's data and your website's credibility at serious risk, making it essential to secure your site. Before we dive in, let's briefly explain what HTTPS is. HTTP, or Hypertext Transfer Protocol, transfers data over the web. However, HTTP isn't secure. Data exchanged through it can be intercepted by hackers. This is where HTTPS, or Hypertext Transfer Protocol Secure, comes in. It adds security by encrypting the data between your browser and the server, making it much harder for anyone to intercept. But it's not just about security. Google prefers HTTPS websites and ranks them higher in search results. Additionally, modern browsers warn users when they visit a non-secure website, which can turn them away. Migrating to HTTPS protects your user's data, improves your SEO, and boosts user confidence in your site. Now, let's dive into how to set up HTTPS on the Cloudways platform. Log in to your Cloudways account and head over to Cloudways Flexible. To enable HTTPS redirection, you must first ensure your site has an SSL certificate installed. You can either use the free Let's Encrypt SSL certificate or install a custom one. Navigate to Servers and choose the server where your application is hosted. Next, select the application you want to secure with HTTPS. Under Application Management, click on Application Settings. Scroll down until you find the HTTPS redirection option and toggle it on. A confirmation dialog will appear. Click Yes to proceed. That's it. HTTPS redirection will be enabled on your application within a few minutes. After enabling the redirection, it's time to verify that everything is working correctly. First, clear your browser's cache and cookies to ensure you're not viewing an outdated version of your site. Your browser should display a padlock icon next to your website's URL, confirming the secure connection. Additionally, use a tool like Why no Padlock to check that HTTPS is being enforced properly. That's all for this tutorial. If you have any questions, feel free to drop them in the comments below. See you in the next video.